The question that I'm often asked is, what's the difference between this blue plastic insert in the USB and the black plastic insert in the USB? Well, generally, if your device is USB 3, it will have on its lead a blue plastic insert on the actual end of the connector. If it's USB 1 or 2, it'll have a white insert or a black insert inside it. So the bottom line is, and the rule of thumb, is if you've got a blue plastic insert in your uh, USB device, whether it be an external hard drive, a camera, a video camera, or whatever, then you're always better off trying to plug it into the socket with a blue plastic insert. It's not 100% necessary, but what it means is it will run at the fastest speed it can run at. If you was to plug it into a device with a black plastic insert, then it will only run at USB 2 or USB 1 speeds. It at the end of the day, it doesn't really matter if you do plug it into the wrong socket. It's going to work, uh, but it just may not run at its full speed. And you might get a message come up on your screen saying this device can run faster if it's plugged into a USB 3 socket. Now, another question that I'm often asked is if I plug in a USB 2 or 1 connection into a USB 3 socket, is it going to work any faster? No, it will only run at the, the speed, the USB 2 or the USB 1 speed that it was designed to run at. But again, it doesn't matter if you plug one of these black or white connections into a USB 3 socket, the one with the blue insert, because it's fully compatible, but it just means it will only run at USB 2 or 1 speed. So, uh, so there you go. That's hopefully a quick explanation on the different connections for USB. Hope this guide helps. Thanks for watching.